In electric power generation a combined cycle is an assembly of heat engines that work in tandem from the same source of heat, converting it into mechanical energy, which in turn usually drives electrical generators. The principle is that after completing its cycle, the temperature of the working fluid engine is still high enough that a second subsequent heat engine may extract energy from the waste heat that the first engine produced. By combining these multiple streams of work upon a single mechanical shaft turning an electric generator, the overall net efficiency of the system may be increased by 50 to 60 percent. That is, from an overall efficiency of say 34 percent to possibly an overall efficiency of 62.22 percent in net Carnot thermodynamic efficiency. This can be done because heat engines are only able to use a portion of the energy their fuel generates. In an ordinary heat engine the remaining heat from combustion is generally wasted. Combining two or more thermodynamic cycles results in improved overall efficiency, reducing fuel costs. In stationary power plants, a widely used combination is a gas turbine burning natural gas or synthesis gas from coal, whose hot exhaust powers a steam power plant. This is called a combined cycle gas turbine plant, and can achieve a best-of-class real thermal efficiency of around 62% in base load operation, in contrast to a single cycle steam power plant which is limited to efficiencies of around 35-42%. to Many new gas power plants in North America and Europe are of the combined cycle gas turbine type. Such an arrangement is also used for marine propulsion, and is called a combined gas and steam plant. Multiple stage turbine or steam cycles are also common. Other historically successful combined cycles have used hot cycles with mercury vapor turbines, magnetohydrodynamic generators or molten carbonate fuel cells, with steam plants for the low temperature bottoming cycle. Bottoming cycles operating from a steam condenser's heat exhaust are theoretically possible, but uneconomical because of the very large, expensive equipment needed to extract energy from the small temperature differences between condensing steam and outside air or water. However, it is common in cold climates to drive community heating systems from a power plant's condenser heat. Such cogeneration systems can yield theoretical efficiencies above 95%. In automotive and aeronautical engines, turbines have been driven from the exhausts of auto and diesel cycles. These are called turbo-compound engines.